Hey YouTube, welcome back. Today we're going to talk about how to reclaim used barbed wire. The pen where our cows used to stay is all wrapped in barbed wire, which you guys saw in one of my previous videos on making the pen. I'm going to show you guys today how we can reclaim that old barbed wire for future use, doing it safe and easy, and how to figure out how long it actually is when you wrap it up. Let's get to it guys. All right, these are the tools I'm going to use for this project. So what we're going to have to do, we're going to have to do our paste count first. We know what's going to be coming from this pole, and it's going to go all the way down to this one right here. So I'm going to step this off real fast and see what we get. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Since we know the paste count is nine, we're going to take our little magic marker and we're going to put down nine to here to here. Since I had to cut the wire right through here to get the cows out and move them, we're going to start here. What you want to do is you want to go from the bottom strand up. So we would have originally done that one, but since it's already long, we're going to leave that one there. And we're going to go through and we're going to knock off all these little clips these little ties that I have on here, we have to remove those. You're going to want to save the end one down here until we get down to there. It's also attached right here to the wire coming up, up here and up here. Just strap down the barbed wire so it won't keep on coming off and slapping your face or hitting your hands or anything else. I use these little electrical wire straps for hooking up Romex and stuff to your house. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to want to find the bottom string and we're going to want to center it put this bad boy right in the middle now as you can see it's between the two or even if it was just one and another one was way back there or whatever i can still put this on and strap it down and make sure whatever you do always use these leather gloves don't use like the mechanics or anything else genuine leather only way to go for doing this i'm going to remove this last clamp that's holding this wire together that's why i have my gloves on now as you can see this side has to go around so i'm going to stretch it back out this way you can keep it nice and taut And I'm just going to start to wrap. Just like so. Now it's behind this one right here. So what we're going to have to do, we're going to have to go underneath it and around it. But at the same time, we're going to want to keep it tight. Not try to rip yourself up and everything else. There we go. Tighten her back up. Finish rounding. I'll even step to this side now. Just so you guys can see what's going on. Okay, I got my wire strap, put that right there. I got my Lyman's, first one, second one. Go around, go around again. Place your wire staple on top like you did down there. Now we know this one is nine because we wrote down right here. So since we wire well, staple it down, now we put nine right here. That's nine paces long. Hello to my new subscribers. Hello to my old ones. Thank you guys for watching. Go ahead and like it. Subscribe if you haven't already. 
And stay tuned. We got a lot of stuff coming on. Take care, guys. Bye bye. Take 10, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yeah.